The Great Okanagan Beer Festival is this Saturday at Waterfront Park, and Power 104 is so happy to be involved once again this year. Tree Brewing is going to be here, and Dave was kind enough to come in to do a little sampling before the festival. These are ones that we're going to be tasting on Saturday at the Great Okanagan yep, all Beer three Festival. Of these will be at the set, uh, festival. What do we have first? This is. First one we have is called a Road Rash Old Style, style Ale. We do, there's a lot of cyclists at our brewery that have had a few whiteboats, so we thought the name was apropos. But this is a cold style ale, comes from, it's a, it's a German style ale, so it's nice and light in color, crisp and delicate, yet there's some slight fruity notes to it. And this is one that we would drink many of? Of course, all of mine are. Yeah, very good. Tastes like another? It tastes like another, <laughs> very refreshing. And for somebody that's not liking an IPA or something that's too hoppy, where would you put the, is it IBUs? Uh, the IBUs on this one run right around 20 or 22. And what percentage of alcohol? Percentage of alcohol on both of these beers, is, oh, this beer, sorry, is 5%. Cheers. Cheers. What are we trying? So this one we're calling our SUP Session Ale. Uh, this is a little bit lighter in IBUs and alcohol. It's four and a half percent. Okay. Um, a little bit more golden in color from the malt. And just it's going to be a little more full bodied than the one we had before the Kolsch. So a lot of a lot of citrusy notes and hop aromas when you take a sweep. So would you say this is more of a summer beer? This is a very, this is one of the reasons we designed it this way. I like to call it a patio beer. You know, you can sit on the patio with your friends and it's, it's never too big that it overpowers you, but it also never gets boring. You can right. hopefully be out there for hours enjoying yourself. Cheers. Try it. Cheers. Mm. You can really smell the malt when you stick your nose into this yep. glass. There's a lot of malt and there's a lot of hops in this one too. And that's that's the like fun that. part of this one is making something that's very flavorful, yet mm -hmm. still you can we call it a session beer because you can session them. You can drink them. So. You could take a bunch of this out on your boat and be good all day. Yes, you could. I mean, relatively speaking, I suppose. <laughs> <laughs> you can try this at the Great Okanagan Beer Festival. Cheers. It is time, the sun is shining. It is time for a refreshing beverage. Grapefruit Rattler. This is a popular one. And this is this is the ultimate summer drink from Tree. Um, it's a mixture of a grapefruit juice, which we make in house, and mix it with beer, about 50-50%. So the final product is two and a half percent alcohol, so it's a little bit lighter. But it's very refreshing. A lot of grapefruit on the nose, but it's not too sweet, so you can again enjoy quite a few of them on the patio. How long have you been brewing this one? This one we've been brewing for about two years now. Yeah. So we brought it out last year, and I think it really hit a lot of notes for people and this year now we are known for it so a lot of people are looking for it in the stores and at the bi so you're going to be keeping this one oh yeah, yeah we'll keep it for now yeah. dave thanks for coming in i think i fell in love with tree brewing just a little bit more we'll see you on saturday at the great okanagan beer festival